What's up guys, it's Matt Collins Jones here, also known as the D365 Geek, and today we're talking about Power Automate on Microsoft Teams, and we are looking at the action which is post a message to a channel as the flow bot. This action allows you to post a message directly to a channel as the flow bot. So the flow bot is a sort of like an automated bot inside of uh, Microsoft Teams that you can use to do certain things. So you usually use the flow bot in terms of like chat, so you could chat to it, get it to run a flow, get it to do certain actions. But what we can also do is we can use it to actually post a message as a bot, which will be a really useful tool, especially um, in certain environments when you want to post things, but you don't want it to be as the person that owns the flow. You actually want it to just be a message that anyone can use, and then you'll actually see where this comes from. So let's take a look at it today. So I'm in Power Automate. I have a manual trigger flow and I can click on new step. I can go down to Microsoft Teams and I can scroll down until I find the action which is post a message as the flow bot to a channel preview. So this is a preview action uh, and will have some preview features as such. So it's going to ask me for a couple of things. It's firstly going to ask me for a team. So I'm going to choose my MCJ demo team. Next, it's going to ask me for a channel. Again, it's required because we are going to post this to a channel. So we will choose my flow test channel. Sounds good. And then we need a message. So we could have a message that says, hey, um, there is pizza in the kitchen. Now, when I see this, this sort of message in a team, I would go running to the kitchen. So that's what I do. Um, and the headline, so this is a subject, so say food update, and we'll see that in the in the flow bar as well. So let's test this out. So let's click on test. I'll perform a trigger action. We'll save and test. We will run the flow, click done. It's done. We can go over to my team's channel and we can say, hey, there's pizza in the in the kitchen. And it's like right there. Um, we don't actually get that little head a bit. Um, I don't think I know why. Um, it, uh, I thought it kind of appeared in sort of like the subject, uh, but I guess the flow bot doesn't really perceive that. So I don't know why that action, that sort of parameter is there. But if you know, let me know in the comments down below. Maybe it's kind of used in the message somewhere that you can use in Power Automate. But yeah, you can you can send a message as the flow bot in here. And we can see that I use this um, and use Power Automate to send the notification. So you could use this in terms of, um, you know, notifying people of things. So if you work on work with a large team, you could potentially have a button that you press, uh, like a flick button or a button on your phone to say, hey, not feeling too great today, not coming to work. You can post that to the team channel and then everyone that is inside your team all gets that notification rather than having to sort of like wait around, see if they're in, talk to their manager, etc. You just go bang, not here, um, not feeling that great. You could use it in things like panic buttons. So you could hit a you know again another flip button or the panic button in your phone. It sends a message to the team. Um, you could send in your your uh, location, your longitude and latitude. People can find out what's going on and try and try and send help. Uh, you could um, send send notifications of when there's pizza in the kitchen, like I've done, because that's a really useful thing. Uh, where I used to work, we used to send emails around when there was like cake in the kitchen, uh, and we would just all go running towards the cake. It's usually for someone's birthday. Uh, but sometimes it was just cake, and who doesn't like cake? So there we go. Um, that's what this action does, um, and that's how you can use it. Um, what do you guys use this for? Let me know in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video, if you could like and share it with your friends, that would be appreciated. If you've not already, click the subscribe button, stay up to date with all my latest videos. I'll see you next time.